importance of using material which has been indexed and shown to be free of diseases that matter in the combination cannot be overemphasized. Using uh, clean material from these sources and matching it to the rootstocks that you need for the job uh, can then be proceeded with and you know that the combination that you produce in a tree is going to do the job you want and last the time that you need to have for the production of that tree. The next step to getting this right is to match the size of the material, the budwood or the graftwood, to the rootstocks that you've, you're going to uh, process into making trees. And uh, this might be a good example. Here's some nice material. If you've got, you've got both small wood here and thicker round wood here. You've got some angular wood here which is very good for micro grafting and micro budding. So all of that can be measured using that gauge. You can measure it. You know when you come to collect your budwood what size it is. So here we have immediately four millimeters. But if we want the other, here we have five millimeters. And we know that that will be correct because we've already measured the rootstocks. So we start looking for material here on the tree for the rootstocks we've got planned to bud or graft.